Welcome back to the trail. We are getting ready to get into Glacier. It is the... Let's see if you can see some mountains behind me. No, just the, just the GoPro cam uh, camera shadow on my face, but there they are. Getting into Glacier, it is September 12th. We've got a four day plan to get to Chief Mountain on the 15th. Got our permits yesterday and we are rocking and rolling. I'm with the uh, late crew today because I'm not trying to get there too fast. And so um, looking forward to it. This is probably one of the clearest days I've had in the last week according to the people that are have been here for a while. So very excited to see what we're gonna have coming up. And without further ado, let's get on the trail. And a very special happy birthday to Longbird. This is his birthday today. And it was great getting to see everybody that was at the hostel here in East Glacier. People I haven't seen since New Mexico. Absolutely awesome to uh, be able to catch up and see what they were, what they've been doing. But I'm back into the wilderness now. Just the coven in myself. Well, I am part of the coven. Anyway, see you guys down the trail. We are getting up to the top of Ptarmigan Pass. I'm not sure exactly where it is, but we're super close. I would assume this is the pass. It's Oldman Lake down there. I think that's Morningstar Lake. Or maybe Morningstar Lake's further down. But we're going to go down there and camp, I think, six miles ahead. This park is stunning. I've been here before as a kid. It's part of like a coach tour bus thing, but um, backcountry, this is my first time. This is everything I'd hoped for and more. Absolutely incredible. There's still snow little pockets around here. We're at like 7,500 feet. Super windy. Alright, I think that's probably the best part of the pass, so see you guys up the trail.
trail we are on day two in Glacier and about to get to the Triple Divide Pass. Here water goes between the Atlantic, Pacific, and Arctic. So we're going to crest it in just a second. Got bugs, bug sauce, and Wolverine in front of us. <clears throat> Got up here early for the sunrise and it's been pretty beautiful. Say hi to YouTube, everybody. It's Arctic, Atlantic, and then Pacific is over on the other side of this wall. Oh, so it's like that. this thing. Yeah, I think so. So you're telling me if I pee right now, my pee will not go through. No, I think you have to be on top of that spire. Oh, I'm not right now. Yeah, that's too much. Okay. It'll go into two oceans, though. I think that's pretty cool. Oh, yeah. More than my, or my pee normally goes. Yeah, this bridge is wild. Get me off the bridge! The middle part! And Glacier National Park. Oh, there's some snow over here. Probably it's a glacier. But, starting day three, heading up to Pegan Pass on our way up to Canada. All right, finally found the trail back on the other side of the road. A little quieter to be talking to you guys, so 
Had a 20 mile day today. Saw a sachet yesterday. Some people had him carry food for them. So they resupplied, I carried all my food. We're gonna see mud today and sprout. And then tonight's our last night on trail. And tomorrow we finish. 19 and a half from Poya Lake where we're camping tonight to the uh, Chief Mountain Terminus at the Canadian border. Two days shy of five months. Hoping there's no bears around the corner. Not that that's going to scare them away, they just won't be surprised because they'll hear me coming. Alright, I'll see you guys up the trail. So we're heading to, and I don't know if you can see it, probably not because I can barely see it with my eyes, but across the mountain there is where the trail cuts. So we're going to go down here and then around and up and over. This is just the most incredible hike I've ever been on in my entire life. Like today specifically. Pegan Pass is where we're going. If you're ever in the area, do this trail. In the most spectacular morning. Why are you guys coming back up? Really? Where? Like close by? Right there. Okay, Grizz. Grizz. And a with mama. Okay. Alright. There's Grizzly. Mama and baby right there. They don't seem mad. No. I had mine out too, yeah. I'm, I don't know why. I'm feeling I, I know why you're not worried. 
<laughs> I've got mine out. I'm doing great with them. Mom, can you? She's smaller than I expected. Yeah, they're both pretty small. Yeah, they're not. Yeah. That's All right, why they're, I'm gonna go that way. Yeah. As, as much as I'm not holding their say, I'm not gonna let them come. <laughs> There's a grizzly. Oh yeah, maybe they'll keep going in the direction they're going. That'd be sick. Yeah. yeah. Keep going that way. That's the key. Also, we should both protect our muscles. So we gotta eat a lot more salmon is what you're saying. Yeah, maybe they'll keep going the direction they're going. That'd be sick. Yeah. yeah. Keep going that way.
that's the key. <laughs> We're gonna eat a lot more salmon, is what you're saying. day. We ended up calling uh, Audible yesterday and stayed at Many Glacier so that we could do Ptarmigan Tunnel, which is super awesome. This is something that I wanted to do and we could never quite figure it out. We were able to figure it out on the trail. Got this little waterfall. And the best part about it is we, uh, we're we not gonna do extra miles. This actually cuts miles off. We got to stop early yesterday. And then about 20 miles today. So we end up saving seven miles total getting to the border. I don't think very many of us slept too well last night. So it was nice to have gotten to bed early. Between the excitement and the wind, all of us were up pretty regularly from what it sounded like everyone talking about earlier. Very different feeling than Katahdin. I feel like I kind of knew that I was going to get here the whole time, as long as I just kept trying. The timeline to get back east is really the only thing that was like, I think legitimately going to stop me. But all of us except for Wolverine are 
doing our second, finishing our second at least through hike. So it's gonna be a special day for her, finishing the first. See you guys down the trail when we get up a little bit higher under the ridge into the tunnel. That up ahead is Tarmigan Wall. We're gonna go up part of it and then across through it via the tunnel. So that's the pass. It's Tarmigan Pass and you can see there's switchbacks that go up and then almost all the way to the top and there's a tunnel up there somewhere that we're gonna go through. Pretty nice view this morning. Just gotta get up this little bit here and then we'll be down on our left. <clears throat> Last climb of the trail. Last pass of the trail. Probably not the last climb. Last big climb. There's the tunnel. Last look. Through that valley on the other side is the border. We're gonna go down quick. See you guys down there. Heading down from the pass. So I figured I should film the outro now because um, things are probably going to get a little bit crazier later. So um, thank you all for joining 
along on this adventure down the CDT or up the CDT. And uh, I'm looking forward to hearing what you guys have to say in the comments about everything that happened in this last section or just anything in general. And I look forward to uh, posting my PCT, you know, theoretically, if I get a permit next year in the summer. Uh, hope you guys can follow along for that too. And um, what I'm going to try and do is talk to Bug about like tracking nutrition and weight along the way. So I think that could be a fun, um, fun thing to take a look at how a through hiker diet and lifestyle impacts your body's health. Uh, but anyway, really appreciate everyone coming along for the trail and I think I've got a moment, uh, 30 seconds for Zen moment that'll come after this and um, look forward to seeing you all down the trail later on. Bye. There's a stone, if you Are come over here and, and look down the lane, uh -huh. you can see the stone monument right in front of the... Yeah. Okay, so the next cones, like in the middle? Like no, so there are monuments on both... Uh, there's one on the left, too. There's one on either side of the border, so we want to stay on our side of the border. We just have to stay on our side of the border. Very careful to be on our side. I feel like I could help off. I think oh, absolutely. Yeah. Definitely. Definitely. Yeah. Just stuff it. Everyone has told her. That's where they pay me. Who are they paying? Who are they taking I'm home? I'm the money man. That's why I'm wearing green. Well, I'm a woman, but you know. Money. Yeah, yeah. The money woman. Money woman. <laughs> this is the outfit. Yeah. Yeah. Nicely done. <laughs> Look at that. Yeah. 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 Oh, God. I just got slapped that side of myself. You just talked about how good you live. Mm, yeah, you look like you. Oh, you yeah. look so good. Where, where's that car? On the right. There's two. There's one on the left, one uh, on the right. So the one on the right is on our side of the border. Which we're allowed to touch. Yes. Oh, yeah. Uh, I don't know who we are. I'll just put it in. I'm going to touch on this side. I'll be safe. Keep my feet on this side. I want to find it from my camera. Leaving you as a stop and report to Canada Customs. Yeah. Stop. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. All photos will be shared. Oh, yeah. Well, it's good to know. Yeah, I mean, they're fine. Oh, I don't even know what's going on. Space. boundary right there. And there's some boundary.
around. And also a triple Gracias. Trans.